The first direct flight train service from China to Britain arrived in London on Wednesday. Another leg in Beijing's plan for closer trade tie with Europe along a modern Silk Road. The train entered Britain from France through the Channel Tunnel, completing a journey of some 12,000 kilometers. The 18-day trip saw dozens of containers packed mainly with clothes and household goods transported from the city of Yiwu in eastern China's Zhejiang province to a freight terminal embarking in East London via Hazakistan, Russia, Belarus, Poland, and Western Europe. London is the fifth European city to find its way onto the ever-expanding map of destination for China's rail cargo. Last year, 1,702 freight trains made the voyage to Europe, more than double the 2015 figure. From UK company facing up to the reality of Brexit, China is an attractive proposition and a train carrying new opportunities. Brand Avenue is a company that already exports British-made goods, including cosmetics and jewelry to China, and chef exclusive Jabi Jacob say he is exploring moving to the rail. So now today I'm gonna interview Jabi Jacob to ask him the reason why he is interested in exploring by rail. Hello Jabi Jacob, can you tell me something more detail about your idea? Um, thank you. So actually, in nowadays situation, we deal a lot of goods uh, with weight a lot in comparison with their value. So therefore, we exp uh, we we spend more money than it. Uh, for example, like baby food or cosmetics. So it is better there is um, a service which is faster than faster than sea but cheaper than air. So uh, it is kind of perfect middle ground for us to choose. Thank you. China is planning another 20 European road for rail freight, and with the world's demand for customer goods continue to grow, all the ingredients seem to be there for rail to help the global economic stand ahead in the 2017 and beyond. Thank you. Bye.